So FIAS International is a family business that happens to manufacture the absolutely best thing there is to freshen the air in your home. It's called the Redelier Fragrance Lamp. We chose the word Redelier because it's the Latin root of the word redolent, which means to diffuse an odor or scent. And trust me, there is nothing you can find that would do a better job of diffusing fragrance in your home and eliminating odors. It is definitely 10 times more powerful than a candle, doesn't have the soot of a candle, and is much safer than a candle. Now let me show you what comes packaged with our red ear lamp. First you'll notice it's in a nice square box which is easy to grab as a gift. And, and we call it a gift set because it comes with everything you need. Let me show you what comes with it. First we have on top your must read the user guide. Please read this for this product. It's very important. Underneath we have some useful tips for you. Inside we have a funnel. Small box which contains our red ear stone and this is the magic that makes it work and this can be purchased separately later on it has a useful life of six months to a year depending on how well you treat it and how often you burn it really so if you take care of it you should get six months to a year out of it we guarantee it as long as you use our fragrances and we have to say that because we use very high standards in making our fragrances and this product is real finicky on how it functions and to get maximum performance out of it you need to use high quality products and we guarantee ours and we guarantee this that's the stone wick next we have a cap set it's a three-piece metal cap set small collar snuffing cap and an open air cap Now we have two bottles of fragrances. These are four ounce bottles of our, some of our best selling fragrances. We have over 50 fragrances to offer and this is, says a lot, but these are in our top sellers. So that way you don't have to worry about picking out anything extra when you do give this a gift, it's ready to go. So we have four ounce bottles of fragrances. Normally they'll be in 16 ounce bottles when you purchase them. Next we'll have the the glass itself. This one happens to be a cobalt blue color. We offer this in a wide variety of colors to choose from. Now I have everything laid out that comes in the box. If you happen to find that it's, something's missing, if you email us or call our toll free number, we'll be glad to rectify the situation. The first thing you want to do is take the stone wick box, open it up, and take out the stone wick assembly. This consists of a wick that is inserted into the stone, which is a ceramic piece, and it has a coating on it that is which the catalyst, the magic that makes this work. And it is pretty delicate in the sense that you don't need to wash or try to clean this. It'll deteriorate the performance of this product. So it needs to come as you see it here, already assembled. If, if it isn't assembled properly, just call us or email us and we'll rectify the situation. Next thing you want to do is take the small collar. It's got a big open end and a small end. Take the end of your wick through the big open end and drop it through the small end, come out the small end, and you now have it assembled. You have the collar and the wick assembled together. And remember, when you buy these stones extra, they do not come with this small collar. So don't throw it away. Hang on to it when you are ready to replace your stone. Now you want to take your funnel, put it in, and pick your fragrance and pour one or two ounces in here. It burns at the rate of one ounce per hour. And a couple hours is more than enough to do what it needs to do, which is... Uh, Fill your house full of great fragrance and eliminate any odors you might have. Now the reason we want to keep it to one or two ounces is that if you overfill this, if you put it more than halfway, definitely keep it under halfway, more than halfway actually will start diminishing the ability of this device to work properly. It will also help contribute to shortening the life of your stone. So keep it under half, one or two ounces, put it in, 
Now that you have your fragrance in, you want to put your stone wick and drop it in there and let it sit. Next, you want to place your solid cap on. And what this will do is keep it covered while you have to wait. You need to wait approximately 15 to 20 minutes. So you might want to go to the kitchen and set a timer. Uh, if you leave it uncovered, it would might, and you go over time, it might make it hard to light. So cover it up in case it, you do go more than 20 minutes. And then come back in 20 minutes and you'll be ready to light it. After the 20 minutes are up, remove your solid cap. Take a lighter. Touch it to the ceramic stone and you'll notice a flame will begin. This flame will be about a five inch flame and this is necessary to heat that catalyst to the proper temperature. Once it gets to the proper temperature, the catalyst is actually going to start eating away at the flame itself and this flame is going to get smaller. This time period is two minutes and for this period of two minutes we recommend you stay with this product do not leave it it'll start slowly get smaller and smaller it has now been our two minutes and as you can see the flame has reduced to about one inch at this point you need to blow out the flame now that you have the flame blown out you should be able to smell the fragrance while the flame was going do not expect any fragrance it's only after you blow out the flame that you begin to smell the fragrance permeating in the air. Now that it's working, it'll be putting out heat. And you put this open air decorative cap on to cover it and protect you from anybody who might be bumping into it or touching it. And speaking of that, the temperature of this is burning right now is about what your oven would be, four or five hundred degrees. Do not try to touch the stone and also the metal cap after it's been on there about 30 minutes will be a couple hundred degrees itself because of the heat it puts out. So if you need to touch it, you might want to or remove this for any reason. You'd want to use something to grab it with and make sure it's not too hot. And now it's ready to actually be put in use wherever you choose. And I'd like to point out that you don't want to put this where there's a lot of airflow, say high ceiling fans on high or a fan blowing a lot. It'll actually, that increases the oxygen level to this and actually it'll make it burn too fast and it'll go out. So place it in a, an area that doesn't get a lot of airflow in the room and make sure while you're considering where to put it that you might uh, work with something on a table. This happens to be a little dish or saucer you can put it on. Uh, you place your lamp on it, and that will give you a place to put any of your accessories, a little, your funnel. And uh, also, I want you to remember when you place this, to, because it is hot, you can get a, several hundred degrees, put it out of reach of your children and pets. As I mentioned earlier, we would like for you to let this burn all the way out. So kind of judge your ounce per hour and let it go. Let it it'll just go dead and get cold on its own. What that'll do is help clean the stone and it'll help lengthen the life of the stone. So this is to your benefit. But let's say you had to go somewhere and you could, didn't want to leave it running and you had to put it out. Well, at this point, you'd want to get something to grab this hot top with, move it out of the way, and while, because it's hot, do not put it on delicate furniture. It might leave a ring on your furniture, so place it on a napkin or something. And then you would take the snuffing cap and put it on there and it'll snuff it out real quick. You will need to wait 15 minutes for it to get completely cold. But you can put this on it and snuff it out. If you have fluid left in it, we highly recommend you use your funnel and pour the fluid back in its original bottle because this will keep the fluid longer and it won't allow it to sit and evaporate or keep soaking up into this wick. So when you're through and you're not going to burn it, you can't burn it out for some reason, then pour it back into its original bottle. This will save you money in the long run and help lengthen the life of this stone wick combination. I'm glad you tuned in. I hope this demonstration has been very helpful to you and you're going to find out we're the best in customer service and we treat everybody like family, and I hope you'll join our family of customers real soon. Thank you.